Hi foodies, welcome to Aishu's Kitchen. Today I am back with one more interesting and tempting recipe that is the aloo kebabs. I hope you all would love this recipe. And for many exciting recipes like this, do subscribe to Aishu's Kitchen and support me. Now let's get started. Let me quickly tell you the ingredients that I'll be using for making the aloo kebab. Here I have taken aloo. I have uh, boiled them uh, to 70%, 70 to 80% I have boiled them. I have not completely boiled them. And then I have taken ginger garlic paste. And for dry masala I have taken garam masala, chili powder, little bit of color, food color and uh, dhania powder. If you want you can add jeera powder also here. And here I have taken 1 tablespoon of uh, rice flour for the crispiness. And I have taken 4 tablespoons of maida here. Then soya sauce, salt as per taste and curry leaves. And we will be using oil for the deep frying. Now let's get started with the recipe. First let us marinate the aloos. So here I will be adding the chili powder here for the aloo. Chili powder, garam masala, dhania powder and food color. I will be adding all this together. And then salt as per taste. Then to this we will be adding ginger garlic paste. I have taken 1 teaspoon of ginger garlic paste. And then we will be adding the rice flour. This is just for the crispiness. Here I have taken 1 tablespoon. Of rice flour if you want you can alternate this with corn, corn flour the maida here we will be using the maida we have taken four three to four tablespoon of maida and to this I will be adding the soya sauce I will be using uh, four drops of four to five drops of soya sauce and then the curry leaves Fresh curry leaves I will be adding. To this let me add little bit of water. Not more, just a little. So until I mix this and marinate, let us keep the oil for deep frying on the other side. So I have mixed all this together and this is now ready. We will marinate this for about 10 to 15 minutes and then we will deep fry our aloo kebabs. Now here the oil is hot. Let me deep fry these uh, potato. I have marinated for about 15 minutes. So I will be adding these potatoes here. So you can see how beautifully these have been fried now. Let us take them out. Our yummy hot potato kebabs are now ready. I hope you all enjoyed this recipe and while serving this let me sprinkle the pepper powder on top of it. Little bit of pepper powder along with the chaat masala powder. This is optional. If you want them to be more uh, tangy and uh, more spicy you can add them. And then let me top it with a little bit of fresh coriander. So yeah this is now ready. This is so tempting isn't it? So for many recipes like this, do subscribe to Aisha's Kitchen and do support me. Love you all. Bye. Take care.